Now, since my last video, you guys have said that the keyboard is quite bloated. So I decided to isolate the problem and remove all the irrelevant keycaps while also removing the screws to take it apart and solder on some wires. And now with the display connected onto the keyboard, let's plug it into the wall. And as you can see, it's running Doom. Well, the keyboard is running Doom. As you can see, it's directly connected. There's no trickery going on. Let's start the game. And it's running remarkably well, actually. Uh, I'm getting around 7 to 8 FPS uh, on normal clock speeds on this keyboard. Though I'm sure if you overclock the keyboard, you can definitely push out like 10 FPS with this. But it's actually running pretty good, especially for a keyboard. And because of these Romer G switches, it actually feels very immersive. It, it, it feels good. Like you'd actually want to play this. So everything for this project will be in the description below on exactly how it was done. So if you're interested, uh, check it out.